y'all. Welcome to my craft room. I know it's a bit of a wreck, and I'm sorry. I'm always so busy. Anyway, I'm going to go through a basic pocket letter while I do my Easter pocket letter with you. I hope you enjoy it, and I'm going to get right down to business. Uh, I've already cut some pieces here, and we're going to go ahead and get started. Uh, here we go. So, as you see, I've already cut my pieces, but I'm going to uh, go ahead and start with the basics here. Um, we use a baseball card protector, and this has nine pockets in it. And the pieces that we cut here are two and a half by three and a half. Uh, two and a half this way by three and a half uh, tall. Um, I've cut a couple pieces a little different today. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and assemble this for you. I'm going to lay this out and show you exactly what I've done. Uh, I wanted to do it a little bit different and put some oomph into it. So, I'm going to lay these pieces out here for you and show you exactly what I've done here. I didn't want to put you through the rigmarole of having to watch me cut each one of these little uh, pieces of paper. So, I went ahead and cut them beforehand uh, with this one. I can't remember, I think I cut it at an inch and a half, or, yeah, an inch and a half or two inches, uh, so that it would give just a little bit of contrast with the yellow, and I just thought that would be cute with this one, um, and this is just a nice spring look, so what I'm going to do here is with these two, I'm going to take my glue and I'm going to glue these together real quick I love these bottles they are um, a really good uh, tip bottle and they get fine lines really well and y'all have to excuse excuse my fingers I'm always cutting my finger or um, yeah I'm always doing something with my finger I think I got my sheet upside down maybe or yep I got it on my the wrong side here so we'll just take our pieces and lay them so that when I flip it, it will be just right. And then this one, we're going to go ahead and glue it. And if you get bottles like this, you always have to remember to put the pin back in it. Because if you don't, it'll dry up. And then you might never get it back in the hole. But I wanted to try to start getting you some videos out here. And let me flip this sheet over. Make sure I've got it the right side up. Yeah, I do. All right, and I can start loading this here for you. And this one goes here. Let's see, make sure I'm on camera, yeah. And this one goes up here. This glue dries pretty quickly, so I'm not worried about it gluing in, inside the pocket. 
Sorry if my arm's in the way. Um, these are papers, I believe, by Echo Park. Uh, an Easter collection. And that's basically what I'm using. The Echo Park Easter collection here. I love, love, love Echo Park. Pocket letters are really easy to make because they are basically an expression of you. Unless you're trying to make an, an expression of the person you are making the pocket letter for. They're basically like having a pen pal and uh, writing a letter because I always decorate the front. and Well, I'll get to that in just a second. Uh, let me uh, throw some decorations here in the front. And uh, this is what I always do if... Uh, let's see, I don't want to move this too far out of frame here. Um, now, you see this one is too big to go into the pocket. So... I really like that right there. So I am going to grab me some double sided tape. Oopsie, that didn't tear quite right. Trying to make this quick, y'all. And I'm going to stick it right there. Anyway, bam. And that says, Hoppy Easter and... You're such a funny bunny, and I can't put that there, but uh, let's see. We need to find some little ones that we can put. We can put an Easter bunny there. Uh, we can put a card there. These, there's a lot of big pieces in here, so... I might have to go snatch out some, uh, well, that looks like I'm just going to have to like do that right here for now. And just, I'm not going to decorate it any more than this. I'm just going to leave that like that as a basic thing. But, uh, I'll probably do different decorations at a different time. Because I feel like I can decorate it better. But there are lots of big decorations in this one. I do like this bunny though. So I'll probably leave him there. He's really cute. But that's the gist of it. And let me just pull these away. Since I'm not going to really use them. Set them aside. Now on the back. You fill it full of goodies. Uh, like what I do is uh, whatever I use on the front, I try to put a whole bunch of the same kind of stuff in the back. And then right here in the middle, I write a note with a little bit of stuff about me and like a hi and a bye. And uh, just, you know, a little bit of conversation to kind of get to know you. Kind of like having a pen pal. And then... 
that's pretty much it. And then you fold it up like this and you send it along with some other goodies. I always like to swap other goodies like uh, about five to ten other items. Uh, depending on how many items that the person I'm swapping with wants to send. And uh, you send it along to your swap, uh, swap partner. So that's it guys. And I hope this wasn't way too confusing for you. Have a great day.